25 to 18 fourth quarter there in favor of the Knicks. And, and you know, you guys really finished this game strong. How tough is it to not get a win when you come back like that? Yeah, it's tough, but we we understand what got us there. The last three minutes of the second quarter and into that third quarter uh, to start it at, uh, we dug ourselves a little hole there. Um, and again, that's the, the thing we're kind of constantly fighting. And, and right now it's the turnovers that's really biting us. You know, that's like three games in a row where we're up around that 20 mark. And we just can't afford to give that many possessions away. Uh, we cut that in half, and we give ourselves a lot better chance to win on the road. Kevin Knox was such a solid first half, and then he picks up those three quick fouls in the third quarter. I, I watched you sit him down. I could tell you were just upset you had to take him out at that time. But then you let him play through it. You know, how do you feel he handled that situation tonight? Uh, he was good. He, he handled it great. You know, and. and that's just part of his his growth, you know. Um, you know, getting touch fouls, you know, fouls away from the ball. Uh, but I, I liked his aggressiveness in the first half. I thought he, uh, you know, made some nice plays. He actually found some guys on the weak side, which is uh, something we've been stressing to him. So he's just gonna keep coming along. When you're talking about teachable moments in, in building this team with Zoe, 0 for 7, but then he comes back and hits a couple shots. Not a great shooting night for him. But how do you coach him in those moments when he's not hitting his shots like that? How else can you help us? That's always that's what I stress to all of them, man. and don't it shouldn't just be you putting the ball in the hole that's gonna help us. Can you come up with a big stop, a big rebound, loose ball, uh, get another guy an open shot? And I thought he came back and really handled it well and attacked and, and made some good plays for us. A turnover was, I mean, you keep talking about for three straight games. Like, what, what was there something different about the turnovers tonight? No, was the no, same same kind of turnovers. Um, you know, maybe trying to make home run passes. That's not really there. Uh, some casual plays, um, some fatigue turnovers, but it's, a, it's an array of different turnovers. And we're just going to keep grouping them, showing them, getting on the floor, you know, really stressing to them. We don't need home runs. We need base hits. And uh, the more I can get them to understand that, the better we'll be. But I do have them at least looking for each other and trying to make plays. And that's, that's what we had gotten away from before, where we were holding the ball a lot. You talked before about wanting DeAndre on the court to kind of coach these guys. There was one play where Kevin got beat, uh, Bogdanovich on an inbound, and he looked like he was doing <laughs> Yeah, That's great. No, that's, and, and that's what I love, the accountability between the group, that they can go at each other and, and they understand that it's a pure thing. It's not somebody, it ain't a blame thing. It's, hey, you got to do your job and this is how you do it. And that's a great element DeAndre has brought to us. And, and you know the guys really respect him uh, when he speaks to him. So, uh, you know, I like seeing that.